Hey guys, it's Kelsey. I'm back with another How to Kill a Kit with Style layout. This is a double challenge, so it is officially the Secret Not Secret Kit Club party weekend, and this is the first challenge I decided to do, which was a mood board challenge. We were supposed to pick one of these color swatches from a decade. I went with the late 90s. This color swatch went really well with the paper pad I was working with, so I figured I would just go from there. Uh, the second part of this is from the Scraptacular Cropping Club to make uh, our design basically like a list. So that's why I ended up doing this is I wouldn't say a title page but it's the first page leading into my Hawaii vacation I kind of always like this initial page to set the vibe for the vacation but also it's usually just a little bit simple just kind of like a fresh place for your eye to start before you get into all the fun things so I thought this was a great way to use a list um, I decided I was just going to basically list like an overview of everything we got to do on our trip I'm just going to basically make a bucket list for what we wanted to do um, and all these things were things we actually got to so it's a great overview for the following pages with the rest of the trip so firstly I decided I needed to figure out how I was going to do my list I knew I had these gold numbers um, from the on trend 2 collection so I, I knew right away those were what I was going to use for my list portion but then I just needed to create some labels and so um, I took this awesome embossing set that Jennifer gave me there was a label in there uh, for stamping and so I just fussy cut it embossed stamp dyed it you know <laughs> you saw me do that a bunch of times so that's what I'm going to use as my labels I'm just going to label um, everything that we got to do on those and place each of them on a number and that's basically the design this is just the photo of the plane ride this is the first spot of land we saw through the plane window um, we flew direct this time from Atlanta <laughs> to Honolulu so um I, I actually liked it a lot better than having a layover. It seemed shorter, weirdly, than one of the legs of the the layover trip. So um, I really liked flying direct. <laughs> um, and we I think we're going to try and do direct from here on out, I think, because uh, it was way nicer. <laughs> uh, but my list just said eat acai. We knew that this was... Probably the first thing we were going to do when we got back was to eat some acai. It was our favorite treat when we were here the first time. Um, so you'll probably see a scrapbook page about that. But that's number one. Number two was do the Jurassic Trail Ride in, um, or the horse trail ride in Jurassic Valley. Uh, we visited a Buddhist temple. We did a rainforest tour, whale watching. We went to the Honolulu Zoo, hiked a volcano. It was extinct. It was a crater at that point. <laughs> um, but we did went to the pineapple plantation, um, Hawaii Stonehenge, and we did uh, quite a few separate hikes. So those are my list. It's just a general overview. Um, I tried to keep it to 10 because that's what I had <laughs> number wise and it just evenly spaced the design so um, I tried to just covered everything broad spectrum um, but this is just a title page so I wasn't too worried about you know going too much in depth because I know as each page comes there will be more journaling and things to explain each of these things uh, there is this little vacation die cut in the die cut pack so I decided I would tuck that in up there I just matted the photo on some white and then on a scrap of green and I tucked a glassine bag behind there I'm just pulling in a few more die cuts I just want a little bit of layering around here but for the most part I want it to be a pretty clean layout I love this rainbow background I didn't get to use it on my first layout so I figured with this being the title page the beginning of my uh, vacation this would be a great place to just let this background paper shine keep it clean keep it simple I pulled in some more of this golden white twine that Lisa sent me in the rack and I save that stuff I love it I'm almost already out of it though <laughs> so it looks really cute on these pages so I've really enjoyed pulling that in um, and then I'm just pulling my thickers I decided I was just going to title this my vacation bucket list since it is a list it kind of references that it's you know the vacation and everything we want to do on this trip so pretty simple um, I'm just gonna get that down and then there are some heart embellishments on this thicker sheet as well so I'm gonna scatter a few of those just kind of as finishing touches <clears throat> 
There we go. And then lastly, I just take some gold Heidi Swap Color Shine and sprinkle it down the center just to bring that gold across the page and kind of connect that center portion to the rest of the page, even though it's just splatter. <laughs> I know my photo just kind of looks like it's floating in the middle of the page and for some reason adding that splatter <laughs> um, top and bottom helps connect it a little bit. Um, so yeah, this will be the first one in my Hawaii page. Everything that follows this will kind of reference this one in the list that we wanted to do. So I thought that was pretty cool. Cool. I think I'm almost done here. <clears throat> I keep wanting to add more um, and I really did want to add more but I mentioned it on the last page I don't have a whole lot of embellishment for this collection so I'm trying to kind of keep it simple in the beginning <laughs> so I don't use all my embellishments in the first couple pages but here are the close-ups so you can really see the colors there the list the embossing <laughs> so stay tuned guys um, as always make sure you check out everyone else who is playing along with how to kill a kit with style not everyone has process videos through the whole month um, but a lot of people do. So it's always fun to kind of see the process between the layout share and the kit share. <laughs> Thanks guys for watching. Bye.